Safi's Concrete Slab Generator allows you to quickly generate a concrete slab that provides you with a quick and efficient design. Its easy to use interface allows you to quickly create a slab based on a simple grid geometry. So, we can simply add a few design parameters which lets you generate a reinforced concrete slab in a quick and intuitive process. Let's now take a look at a brief example to show the new functionalities of the reinforced concrete slab generator. To generate the model, we first need to define a grid. This grid will define the length of the different spans of the slab. The supports of the slab will be located at each intersection of the grid. First, we define the grid plane as the XZ plane. Then, let's make 5 spans of 5500 millimeters and three spans of 5,000 millimeters. Set the grid as a base for the generation. Different types of support conditions can be defined for the slab. The column below the slab, the column above and below the slab, and the column above the slab on grade. For this example, we will use the option Generate Column Below the Slab. We will now define the section type used for this slab. It will be set as a 30 MPA concrete with a thickness of 250 millimeters. And we will give this a name. The design group is used for the automated design of the slab. For this example, we will use 15 M bars for the top and bottom row with a cover of 20 millimeters. We will leave the other parameters to their default value. We'll go ahead and give it a name the side extension parameter allows to extend the perimeter of the slab to fit nicely with the side of the column. We will keep it as a default value of 200 millimeters. And now for the column parameters. We will define the section used for the columns as a 400 millimeter square section made of 30 MPA concrete. And we will give this a name. Here is the overview of the column section. The design group we will use as a default setting of 25M longitudinal bars and 10M for the ties. And we will give this a name. We can set this design group for the generation. Finally, we will set the height of the column below the slab to 3600 millimeters. We can now launch the generation of the slab by pressing OK. We now have a complete slab model. Any element generated with this tool can now be edited if desired. This slab is now ready to be attributed with loads and analyzed with the Safi GSE automated design. The advanced analysis of the Safi GSE gives numerous useful information for your project, such as the bending moment, the shear forces, the long-term deflection, the concrete design limit state, and also each design strip provides specific information about its limit state and the bending moment resistance envelope. Also, the punching shear above each column is also automatically calculated. The long-term deflection with consideration of the cracking of the slab can also be evaluated at any point with a complete time history graph. Several ISO contours gives an advanced view of the forces in the slab. And finally, the reinforcement of the slab is calculated automatically with the SAFI GSE automated design and can be manually edited at any time. The slab generator is a quick and easy way to start your next project. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to SAFI's YouTube channel and visit our website www.safi.com to stay updated on the latest features of the software.